um so when i wash my hair with cold water what it does is that it may it makes the cuticles of my hair to to close up because you know you know when you when you when anywhere in your body you're feeling cold that even in your skin it tightens up when you're feeling cold so that's the reaction that my head does when it receives that cold water so the cold water goes in you know the strands of my hair and once it comes in the hair's response is to shut up and that for me seals in moisture the other thing is i use the natural oils of my body to take care of my body i don't use any lotions or creams oils on my body you know how people you know especially in the natural movement they use coconut oil they use these essential oils which are actually pretty good i used to use them myself but it's cheaper this way to just let your body produce its own stuff i mean that's how we were created in the beginning god created us with the natural sebum of our body which should be produced from the food and from the food and water that you, we consume our body makes up those oils and you have those sebaceous yeah they're called sebaceous glands all over your body all over your your skin all over under your skin surface and even in your scalp because that's part of your skin though you have hair growing you have hair growing all over your body so those sebaceous glands they secrete this oil this waxy oil that is supposed to coat your body and that is supposed to be your protection now because of our lifestyles the hot water that we use to wash our bodies the harsh soaps you know that layer gets stripped off and those glands they get dam damaged because of those harsh soaps and all those things see even even my hands you know hands quickly dry but because i've gotten my body used to not using those things i can now go on without it i can get away from me woman <laughs> so <laughs> so even my hands you know you know how hands quickly dry she distracted me that was my sister hands dry easily and so that's why we use these oils these lotions and stuff but because i've gotten my body used you know to producing this sebum again i can depend on it i'm going way off topic here i'm straying okay i had planned it this way that it was just going to be a rant so my point there is that i don't use any lotions i don't use any cosmetic stuff on my body and that's why even with my hair i use the cold water because the cold water does not entirely strip my body and the other thing when i boil the water it softens it and soft water it pulls dirt off it pulls dirt away if you want to get a good clean cold water not necessarily cold water but soft water it does a great job in cle in cleansing in cleansing even when you drink it soft water not so much i mean hard water not so much but it also has its benefits i might follow do a follow up to this video you know if anyone needs any clarity on some things i'll definitely get on that but the point here is if you want your hair to be healthy if you want to have healthy skin i've been told that i've got pretty healthy beautiful skin that's what i do i've discussed it in my other videos that you've got to take care of what you put into your body i am a vegan vegetarian but i do like to say whole foods plant-based and strongly contemplate contemplating raw not just contemplating though but i've made the decision to go raw vegan i'm just not moolad enough to do it as yet so 
people take care of what goes into your body and from there your body will produce the stuff that will take care of itself so you don't have to use all these things I will list below because I know some people like to use oils I'll list some oils that are similar to your natural sebum that you can use to grow your hair to take care of your skin yeah pretty great stuff it's available and here's the other thing I don't want to get to you know complicated sciences stuff so if you are bothered by the simplicity of my videos sorry if you enjoy the simplicity of my videos yay thank you um, I'm glad but my videos will stay quite simple because they are for the average person it's edu free education setting you free with knowledge education but it doesn't have to be complicated you know stay safe stay lovely and be <gasps> edu freed <laughs> Forgot to tell you, more links below for hair health.